Given the information that negative 6 times the quantity of x minus 3 plus 3 times the quantity of x minus 5 equals negative 18, and that we're trying to prove that x equals 7, what is the third statement in the proof? So we already have our first statement, which is the given information, and we have our second statement after we've used the distributive property on this equation. Now we need a third statement. What is going to come next? Well, remember our goal is to prove that x equals seven. We're trying to solve for x. So what would you do next to solve for x from the statement in line two or from that equation in line two? Well, we would try to combine our like terms and simplify the left side of that equal sign. We could combine negative six x plus three x to be negative three x and 18 minus 15 to be plus three, and then equals negative 18. So that is the equation that would be in statement number three, making our answer choice D, negative three X plus three equals negative 18.